Yeah. We back again. Tron and Kimberly. Moses. Welcome to Team Moses Vlogs. Will you watch us do life? And enjoy marriage. On our journey. I love you. You love me. I love you. You love me. I got you back, baby. I got you back, baby. I love you. You love me. I love you. You love me. dresser I think for mom so I'm gonna open it and maybe tonight Bay will help me assemble it because the last dresser I put together and it fell apart the same day <laughs> so I said no more dresses for me to put while wow, reading the instructions yeah I, I work so hard I work hours you guys on this dresser and it fell apart yeah so it's not a wooden dresser. I was so scared about a wooden dresser. It's one of those storage bin th dresser things. It's like a fake dresser. But hey, you gotta do what you gotta do. So it's a box, actually, inside of a box. So yeah. And guys, we all get packages. We love getting packages, you guys. I know Babe does. Yeah, packages. but then. Y'all probably don't won't see this the way I said, but really, we don't plan on staying here long. So we really not trying to fill up this place. You know, I really didn't even want Pumpkin to buy a dresser because we 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 plan on leaving soon. We'll fill up the next place, but this place I really didn't want to fill this up. So if you see space around here, that's why you see space. Cause we could have had it filled by now. Yeah. Pumpkin want to fill this place up, don't you, Pumpkin? Of course I do. No, I don't want to fill this place. I'm going to start the movie room in the next place, team. All right, so this, like this little bin thing. And you know, you got to assemble some stuff. Yeah. So Babe won't have to do this. But it's all <laughs> Yeah. I don't, know, I don't know when. Babe, babe got uh, Monday motivation. Babe okay. got the flyer. Babe got the... Vlog. Alright, so this is it, team. I'll show you the finished product soon. Yeah. What's up, team? Pray all y'all having a wonderful morning so far. We just here chilling. About to get on the prayer line. Pumpkin prayer line. Want y'all to get on it too. 30 days of praying for faith. I'll put the number right here. Right there. 30 days of praying for faith. I want y'all to call in too. Yeah. Anyway, she fixing herself up so she can look good on the prayer line. No, actually, I gotta do a video. I, I, I've been slacking. I said I need to do video. So, yeah, you guys, I just been having my hair up. And a little bun like this, everything brushed up for days. So I'm just like, today I'm gonna put some curls in my hair and put my wrap on. Yeah, so it's not curling too good because I need to wash my hair again. Yeah, that's how I know it's time to wash. It's getting thick. Yeah, but I'm excited, you guys. Me and Babe are gonna have a photo shoot soon. So yeah, I'm excited. I'm gonna get new photos this year. Yeah, for new things. Yeah. All right, team. We're gonna get with y'all later. Cause I'm about to have me something out of the microwave. I can't show y'all what this is. Maybe one day I will show y'all. 
If I show y'all this, y'all not gonna credit me for letting y'all know about it. Y'all not gonna credit me. Black people don't give you credit for nothing. Or they give you credit for blame. They blame you for something. Anyway, I'm just joking. I'm just joking. I'm just being silly. We about to enjoy our day. And I'm going to be honest with you. I could use a nap. We got to go get the kids from school. After the prayer call. Then we're going to go get the kids. Uh, I forgot what kind of pizza that is. Um, not CeCe's Pizza. Some of y'all probably never heard of CeCe's Pizza because I think it's a uh, South Carolina thing. It might be a Carolina thing. Um, what's the name of the pizza? Little Caesars. Little Caesars. If any of y'all have been watching the vlog for any amount of time, y'all know what kind of pizza I like. I like New York pizza from Myrtle Beach, which is like an hour and 15 minutes away. And I would drive that hour and 15 minutes away for that pizza. Would I drive an hour and 15 minutes away for Little Caesars? I probably wouldn't drive 15 minutes away for Little Caesars. But the kids like it, so yeah. Maybe one day I can introduce them. Well, Mariah's picky. Maybe one day introduce Mark Mont to like some real New York pizza. He'll love that. I'm telling you, New York pizza, you gotta, you gotta fold it. And Pumpkin complained, like, we had some pizza. Um, we were somewhere in North Carolina where she was preaching. We had a hotel, they had us in the hotel, and some pizza was sent to us, and it tastes good. It wasn't New York pizza, but it was pretty close. And it was dripping uh, grease, but that was good. That was good. She was complaining about that, complaining about it's too greasy. I've never looked. I never heard nobody in New York ever complain, this piece is too greasy. No, I mean, come on, it could be going down your face. And you enjoying it. Y'all know, some of y'all know what I'm talking about. One day I want to try that, uh, I want to try Chicago pizza. Because those are the two places that you hear about, I'm telling you, that specialize in pizza. New York, Chicago. Well, really, you got to throw Jersey in there, too. Because New York and Jersey, they like, they like cousins. They like first cousins. And a lot of Italians are in Jersey. So when it comes to pizza, I want my pizza made by an Italian. When it come to Chinese food, I want my Chinese food made by Chinese. When it come to soul food, I want my soul food made by... You know what I'm saying? Do y'all get what I'm saying? I don't want to go to the Chinese restaurant and a brother in there making my Chinese food. I don't want to go buy pizza and somebody else is in there making my... I used to go to this place called Brick Oven. Look. I want an Italian to make my pizza, okay? You're not going to get the best. Like, if you want Jamaican food, say you want some Jamaican food, you want some curry goat, you want this, you want that, you're not going to get the best if somebody else is making it. You understand what I'm saying? If I want salvation, I go to Jesus. I don't go to Buddha. I don't go to Krishna. I don't go to Muhammad. I don't go to all the other names. You go to the person that specializes in that. The Bible said there is no other name under heaven given among men whereby we must be saved. Now see that? I done flipped from pizza to Jesus. But anyway, y'all get the point I'm making, right? Y'all get the point I'm making. But anyway, that's, that's what it is. That's what it is. All right, so, so we still haven't really fully decided what we're going to do for Valentine's Day. But Pumpkin CD come out on Valentine's Day, so check that out. Prophetess Kimberly Moses. Her CD come out on Valentine's Day. And, uh, yeah, that's about it, Tim. That's about it. So get you some pizza made by an Italian. Don't let a brother make your pizza. Don't let another make your pizza. Don't let a brother or another make your pizza. Get an Italian to make your pizza. And then you're going to get some real pizza. You hear me? You're going to get some real pizza. But anyway, Tim, I pray that y'all understand what I'm saying. Anyway, 
We're going to get back up with y'all later. About to get on the prayer call and pick up the kids. All right, stay tuned. Stay tuned, Saints. Because some surprises coming. And look, we still ain't figured out exactly what we're going to do for New Year's. I mean, not New Year's. <laughs> Team. I told you I was a little sleepy. Not New Year's. Valentine's Day. So help us with that. Help us with that. I think we got one suggestion, but help us with that, team. All right? Gonna catch back up with y'all later. What's up, team? What's up, team? So you guys, I just did a broadcast on Periscope, like not too long ago. And we're back home now, and I'm making ribs. You know I love some ribs, right? Ah. Oh. It smells so good in my nostrils, like, ah, yeah. So uh, I just put it in the oven and I just put like the slab of rib and I'm going to bake it for about two hours. And then I'm gonna put some barbecue sauce on it. I'm gonna let the barbecue sauce cook into the ribs. It's gonna be good, yeah. So I just season it with two kinds of seasonings. I use uh, the Creole, Tony, Cacciatore, I think I said it right. I might have said it wrong. I use that seasoning and the burger seasoning that my husband brought. Yeah. So I brought that. that you would never, I would never buy no burger seasoning because I don't really eat burgers like that, you know? Well, I use it on the ribs because it's beef. Why would you use that one taco seasoning on the steak? Okay, so, yeah. So, anywho, you guys, we were doing, like, prayer calls, like, every day. Call in. It's going to be awesome. One of my students are going forth tonight. I'm excited to hear how the Lord's going to use her. And, yeah, me and babe are planning something romantic. Yeah, for Valentine's Day. I can't wait. What you mean? Did you smack your teeth? Okay. Yeah. You guys, I put 30 romantic ideas and this month's issue of Rejoice Central Magazine. Check it out. And let us know which one me and Babe should do. If you read it, if you really support the ministry, amen, check that out. I put some good stuff up there, you guys. <laughs> yeah, 30 romantic ideas for married couples. So I'm excited. I don't know what we're going to do, but it's going to be something romantic. Yeah. All right, here we go. team just trying to get my ribs they should be done in like 20 something minutes they said cooking for like two hours but i don't know how'd it look team mm. no less some ribs yeah i'm gonna put some uh some sesame oil on it <laughs> i like this you guys i was wondering about you know cook with this but you know chinese people got some good ribs did we get ribs from the chinese restaurant they're they're, they're good some sesame oil on it yep that's gonna be good and then put a little soy sauce yeah they got some yeah mm. that's good it smells good too don't it Let me just put some barbecue sauce on it. It's looking good. What up, team? For the day, I am cooking shrimp. Look at that Cajun style shrimp, you guys. Yum, yum, yum. Y'all look a hot mess today. Yeah. You know what? I slept and I woke up and the wrap was on the pillow. Yeah, so my hair is all over the place. It's thick. But I want to show you. Uh, Bet like he ain't see me. I want to show you these ribs I made. It smells good, baby. Yeah, so I'm going to show you guys the ribs. Babe's all happy. Barbecue ribs. They look it looks good. good baby. Yeah. I cooked them yesterday, but we never got a chance to eat them. But yeah, they saw you making it. Yeah, so I just put the barbecue sauce on it. Yeah, mm -hmm. and Babe said he'll never eat it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but they're, they're, they're good. It looks yummy and t it smells yummy too. Yeah. So I'm making uh, some mashed potatoes right quick. That is done. I'm making that really quickly. And yeah, my mom. He liked the apple pies. 
50 cents from Walmart. I got a bunch of these different uh, things. I had one. I had a patty pie one day. Small one. It was delicious. 50 cents. You can't beat that. Yeah, a lot of people be, uh, you know, they be missing out on Walmart now. Walmart got some good stuff. Yeah, let me um, cook in this. One of these things. It, yeah, it's easy to make, like less than a minute. And I got some green beans in there. I'm going to give you the babe. Team, I do think the ribs look good. I think they smell good. But I will never eat them. I do. I really do think they look good. Mmm. That smell. If y'all could smell that smell. It smells delicious. I've never tried ribs. It's not that I don't like them. I just, I ain't never tried them. No, thank you. I don't want, I don't want no ribs. You got, I, need, I need somebody to help taste it. You need somebody to help taste it. Make sure it comes out right. Someone mm. that... You can taste it. Yeah. But it's going to be in the. Because um, I'm not. It's going to be succulent, smothered barbecue ribs. Tron Moses. Tron Moses ain't tasting nothing. She already know that before she asked him. She knows certain stuff I'm just not going to eat. It's just like I ain't never, ever going to eat no chitlins. I'm not curious about what it tastes like. I don't care what you put on it. Let's see what's going on over here, team. Mmm, my wife got it going on over here. You show them that, baby? Yep. Okay, well, I guess y'all saw, saw the shrimp. All right, get back with y'all in a minute, team. Mm -hmm. About what he wants, what I want. Man, Did he, was he lying to you? If he locked out, he so, locked out. how can he lock the door, baby? So this is this is Mama's plate with the shrimp, and this is Mariah's plate. She don't really care for shrimp, but that shrimp look good. It's gonna be amazing. Yeah. Yeah, he's locked out. Do it. You be the judge, team. Mariah, come wash your hands and eat. What's up, team? It's your cousin, Tron Moses. It's the leader of the team. Yes, I'm the leader. I'm the coach. I take that back. Jesus the coach. Jesus is our coach. Every knee shall bow down. Hold on, team. Let me wash my hands real quick. Put that in the oven. My beautiful wife is in bed working. Don't want to get up. I'm in the kitchen seeing about dinner. Mm -hmm. I bet he going to have this. The shrimp and stuff. All this? Yeah, and then the ribs and the other one. He better not come back for nothing else. Come back for nothing. All right. She's having, Mariah's having chicken nuggets and tater tots. And the way my mom do his, he put chili on his... It's tater tots. Yeah. That'd be looking good, you know? He's having, he having a real dinner. She's picky. He having a real dinner. He having ribs, mashed potatoes, uh, seasoned shrimp, and string beans. Yeah. She don't want, she want um, the tater tots and the nuggets. So that's what's up. That's what's going on here in the Moses house. Anyway, team, you know what? I'm going to say bye to y'all. We're going to see y'all on the next one. We love you. We appreciate you. We pray that y'all continue to watch us. And that's about it, team. Punkin is right over here, but I can't show y'all right now. 
Yes, she has all the clothes on, bitch. <laughs> but anyway, catch y'all on the next one. Deuces. Deuces. I love you. You love me. I love you. You love me. I got you back, baby. I got you back, baby. I love you. You love me. I love you. You love me. You love me, I got you back